Welcome to Wednesday. So, Pikmin 2 has its ending scheduled, which is very exciting. Because that means we can, clear, we can clean our hands of this, wipe our hands of it, wash our hands of it. I never to think about Pikmin 2 again. Thank God. <laughs> like, I don't dislike the game, but it's definitely not as good as the others. And there's a vlog when I finished the game on stream that I talked more in depth about this, but the game is, is very rough, and I don't enjoy it being as rough as it was, especially compared to other games in the series. Thankfully, like I said, I don't have to think about it again. Pikmin 2 episode 50, which is the ending, comes out on the 19th of this month. Might be out by the time you get this. I'm not sure when this is coming out, but you know what I mean. Exciting. Which means Luna can now work on whatever the next project is. I think we said it was going to be Luigi's Mansion. Today was the ending of Paper Mario, and technically there is probably going to be one more stream. I do intend on doing the Pit of 100 Trials, but for all intents and purposes, the game is done. I haven't gotten the stream up yet, but that's fine. I There's plenty of time to get that going, but it is very exciting to know that it I've played through all the game, we have that done before. Amber goes back to school, because if I didn't have it done before Amber went back to school, I was not confident that it would get done in any reasonable amount of time. So definitely, definitely glad about that. That is now three series under her belt. One was the um, Super Mario Galaxy Versus, two was the first Kingdom Hearts game, technically three was uh, watching Chain of Memories, so this would really be the fourth. But still, it's exciting because, you know, Amber does do enjoy doing it. I enjoy doing the, the these series with her. And it is something for us to bond over, which is something I really appreciate. I don't, I'm sure she does too, but definitely, um, it's definitely a big, like, bonding experience, these, these playthroughs, because gives us a brand new perspective on these games, whether we've played them before or not. So having that there is very nice, in my opinion. But I'll leave the uh, future thoughts for future me, because we have plenty of other games planned, so I'm excited. And if you watch Paper Mario, either on the VOD channel, on the streams as they happened, or on plays when it comes out. Thank you for watching and indulging in our uh, stupidity. Welcome to Friday. Today was the first day that um, our trucks got moved. And instead of, you know, lowering our amount, they raised our amount. Sort of. So last week on, on Wednesday, the, the 31st, while my coworker was on vacation, we got a truck that was 2,100 cases. Knowing that we got an excessive amount, they still sent us 1,800 pieces on this truck, which makes no sense to me because they didn't give us extra hours to work through the bigger load. So what <laughs> did they expect us to do with all this stuff between now and next week? Allegedly, it's because um, we had extra time between trucks, but that doesn't make any sense because, again, we just got 2,100 pieces on last week's truck. What the fuck? <laughs> so it took us to, like, mind you, I'm only scheduled to 10, uh, but it took us to, like, 9.30, 9.45 to get it done. <sighs> I hate it so much. Hopefully it's going to continue to go down, but we'll see. 
It's a headache all around, though. Came home and went right to bed, as you would expect. And now it's, uh, dark out. Anyway, I'm still tired, so I'm gonna cancel stream tonight and just try to get extra sleep. And I'll see how it goes. So this is a desk that Olivia said she didn't want. So she decided to put it in here because I said, yeah, I could probably find something to do with it. Now the problem with that is I have no idea what the hell I'm going to do with it. And now you've probably noticed it's sitting here for a few days, like in the background, if you paid attention. But like, I have no idea what I'm going to do with it. I guess I could maybe put it in my bedroom somewhere, but even then, I don't know where. So it's like, huh, what the hell am I going to do with this? I don't know. But it's here. And now I have addressed it. So now I kind of have to figure something out. Well, wish me luck. So, today we have to get a new washing machine. And there's more to it than that. But I'll, I'll focus on the washing machine today. So the old washing machine matched the dryer that's down there. I don't know if I've ever shown them. Um, they were both old Samsung, not old, but like they were both Samsung uh, washer dryer front loader things. And we were starting to have a problem where the drain wouldn't drain in the, um, in the washing machine, which is annoying because that could be like five different things. So we checked all of the things and found out that um, the drain pump went bad and, and died. And the problem with that is that it is a huge pain in the ass to try to fix that because you have to take damn near the entire thing apart. So it, we figured that by the time we were done paying labor and, and time for the, uh, some kind of repairman, may as well just get a new washer. So we did. And I like the new one. It is taller. It's not as deep. And I've only, like, played with it a little. I haven't done, like, an actual load on it yet. But definitely, um, definitely, like, seems good. Hopefully, it stays good. Maybe it'll be better than the old one. Who knows? But either way, it is annoying to see it, um... It was annoying to see it go down. But I'm happy with the new one. And Mom and Joe are happy with the new one. And as long as it, you know, does its job, we'll be good. For now, I don't have much else to say, so I'm gonna start heading to bed, because it is a little late now. In addition to the washing machine yesterday, we did also get this, which has a lot of cool stuff to it. it can do regular... Okay, hang on. It's not focusing. There we go. Bake, convection baking, air fryer, no preheat, slow cook, convection roasting, broiling, um, whatever multi-racks is. Steam bake, steam roast, keep warm, delay start can self-clean and steam clean, which is really cool. And then there's other stuff that, I don't know, it's fancier than the old one. Um, it's fancier than the old one, be and it is nice, uh, brand new obviously, but uh, we've, we've done a little bit of cooking on it, and it just... So one of the things with the old one was that one of the burners was like a small burner surrounded by a big burner and if you lowered the flame it would switch and so it was kind of hard to like maintain a constant heat at, at certain t like temperatures because it would switch. So 
so just little things like that are nice to have like changed and, and fixed and what have you. Unfortunately, we haven't quite gotten rid of the old one. It is still sitting here on the deck. But we'll get rid of it when we can. All in all though, we're, we've been pretty happy with this new one. This is the little bit of time we've had it. And personally, I think that's a good thing. <laughs> that means we can't really, uh, can't really complain. I've been leaning like this on my desk a lot lately, I know. But, um, sometimes it's a struggle to keep my head up when I'm tired. Anyway, I went to one of Joe's shows today. He, um, still, still the singer in that band. Um, so I went, I'll play a couple of clips. But, um, it was fun, just tiring, didn't get home till late, not much else was going on today, so I'm gonna go to bed. I'd like to thank you all for watching, hope you had yourself a damn good one, and I'll see you next week.